Hi guys, I go by the name of Pondu. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time, don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more great content every week. Don't forget to leave a comment. Tell me what you think about this video in the comment section below. I'll be super glad to hear from you guys. Mouth Award winning rapper Chef 187 has opened up about his feelings towards the death of Zambian mu music producer Kevin Shower, popularly known as Cream Dollar. The numero uno featured on Diamond TV's On The Table show with Chimweka, where he expressed sadness over his passing despite being aware of cream dollar battering an illness for some time. He recalled moments when they shared the house along with Max 2 and DJ Hector God, describing the late cream dollar's personality as more on the quiet side but still quite jovial. The rapper also disclosed that he has been affected by the COVID-19 effects such as bans on gathering but has said it hasn't been so hard for him to adjust because he is already an Indo person. He explained that he feels it mostly on weekends when he's usually supposed to be out performing. Cream Dollar will be remembered for a huge number of hit songs that he worked on. Hello. Hey Chef, how are you doing? Uh, I'm very fine, thanks. Um, first of all, condolences as well to you because I know you've worked with Cream Dollar uh, for a while. But what, what was your first reaction as soon as you heard of his demise? Uh, well, uh, first of all, Cream has been unwell for, for some time now. So when I first heard of his passing, I, it's something that I couldn't really believe. Up to now, I'm still trying to process even though I've known about him being as well for some time. Mm. Uh, how long have you known him? Just approximately, how long have you known uh, Cream Dollar? Because we would hear him on uh, productions that you did way back in the day, uh, but probably you've known him even way before that. How Approximately how long have you known him? Uh, I've known Cream Dollar since 2010. Mm. Yes. Um, I think Maki too found him somewhere he met Maki too somewhere. I think it was Muflira or what, or something. And then he came down to Ndola. That's how come he joined Alpha Entertainment. So um, I was I met him in 2010 at Alpha Entertainment. Mm. So we've been working ever since, and we've been close friends. He's someone I've I've lived with for for like four years. Um, Oh, okay. So you lived with him back yeah. in the day? Yeah, we were living together. There's, you know that sort of thing where the studio is just that is, you're just building up a brand uh, as in the studio Alpha Entertainment and um, there wasn't really we didn't really have much so we lived together. Mm -hmm. uh, me, Mark and there's a guy called DJ Hector God mm -hmm. and a couple of other people what, what type of so person? Like, you, okay, can carry on. Sorry, can carry on. No, I was about to say he was like a brother. Oh, mm. what 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 yeah, type of yeah. personality uh, did he have? What 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 character, uh, you know, did he possess? Was was he a loud person? Was he very quiet? Uh, well, I would say he was he was a, a a quiet guy, but at the same time he was a happy person. He was a jovial person. Um, someone that never really took things personal. Uh, yeah, and very creative at the end of the day. Mm. Mm. So um, he was someone that anyone could relate, could relate easily relate with because of his personality. I don't think there's anyone out there that would uh, that would say anything bad about Cream Don. <laughs> he was just that sort of person. What's the first thing that comes to your mind when you think of, of Cream Dollar? Any particular memory, any particular time that you think of when you, th when you think of him? Well, like I said, this is the person I lived with. So there's, there's a lot of fond personal memories that, that come to mind when I, when I hear the name Cream Dollar. Mm -hmm. It's not just music or the song you produced for me or Mark or anyone, uh, but it's, it's just the the type of person he was and his personality mm. okay. mm, that, that uh, come to mind when I, when I hear that name. Mm. 
Okay, let's get to wrap it up with uh, the current situation, COVID-19. How are you personally coping during this time? I'm sure uh, a lot of your shows have been cancelled and there's, uh, there's so much, uh, you know, that is happening in a negative way uh, for a lot of entertainers. <laughs> How are you surviving during this time? Uh, well, uh, it's really a confusing time. Uh, the, the only hope we have is that... Uh, is the fact that all this we we know to say all this that is happening is, is just a phase. It's uh it's just a time that is going to pass at some point. So I think that is the only hope that we are holding on to. Um otherwise uh if we really want to see this thing go away within the shortest period of time, I would just I would just love to encourage everyone to just adhere to the instructions from the Ministry of Health and uh, the World Health Organization. Mm. And on a lighter mm. note, I've been asking different entertainers this. What are you personally doing to stay entertained during this time? What am I personally uh, Well, with me, I've always been an indoor person. So mm -hmm. I don't really, it hasn't really hit me like that because I'm used to being home anyway. Um, I think it's only on weekends where I feel like, oh, I was supposed to be out there. Otherwise, Kade is a judge in a country. Kade is a judge in a country. All right, Chef187, yes. uh, I know this was abrupt. I just called you uh, literally uh, a few minutes ago just to get your, your tribute. But thank you so much for coming through and sharing this, uh, uh, your take on uh, the demise of Green Dollar. Uh, thank you so much for having me. And I would, I would once more um, want to say, Earth in peace to Krim Dola. He's uh, definitely going to be remembered for a very long time to come. All right. Sheffy, thank you so much for coming through. Great stuff. Thank you. All right. So that was Chef 187 giving us his take on um, the death of Cream Dollar. I know so many people uh, are touched by this, his fans alike. You can also let me know what your favorite song produced by Cream Dollar was uh, by dropping a comment in the comment section. I know some of you have already said sending uh, your condolences and how uh, touched you are by the news of his demise. And uh, we continue saying rest in peace to um to cream dollar who is kelvin uh, simwinga all right that's all right for you today guys if you did enjoy the video please don't forget to leave a comment in the comment section below tell me what you think about the video you just watched in the comment section below i'll be super glad to hear from you guys once again i go by the name of i love you peace i gotta go